Okay, in this example, we're going to find the equation of a circle with centre 2, 5, radius 8. All we've got to do is put those values into our circle equation. So the x coordinate of the centre is 2, so we would have x minus 2 all squared. The y coordinate is 5, so we would do y minus 5 all squared. And that equals the radius squared. 8 squared is 64. So that is the answer to part A. In part B, we've got a circle with centre minus 3, 1, radius 5. So the x coordinate of the centre is minus 3. So we're going to do x minus minus 3. We'll just write that as x plus 3. We've got a y coordinate of the centre of 1. So we'll do y minus 1, all squared. And that equals the radius squared, which is 25. So writing down the equation of a circle when you know the centre and radius is as easy as plugging numbers into the formula. All right, this time we've got a circle with centre 4 minus 5, radius 3. So part A, we're going to do x minus the x coordinate of the centre, so x minus 4, all squared, plus y minus the y coordinate. y minus minus 5, we write as y plus 5, all squared, and that equals the radius squared, 3 squared, is 9. So that's part A. In part B, We've got a circle with centre 0, 8 and radius 7. Rather than writing x minus 0 squared, we can simply write x squared. Then for the other part, we're going to have y minus 8, all squared, equals the radius squared. 7 squared is 49. 